Good morning. Welcome to Morning Canvas. I'm Nikki Boyer, and here is your Daily Dose. You may know actress Jemima Kirk from her wild child role as Jessa on HBO's Girls, but did you know that she's actually also a painter? She considers herself an artist first and an actress second. So if you're in the San Francisco area, you can catch her solo exhibition of oil portraits at Fulati Projects through May 10th. Her paintings on display feature all female subjects that are of her friends, herself, and even her three-year-old daughter. The Book of Mormon recently celebrated its third year anniversary on Broadway. Since it premiered at the Eugene O'Neill Theater in 2011, the irreverent musical has grossed over $245 million. It's also spawned touring productions. The Tony winner is currently playing an extended set of dates in Los Angeles at the Pantages Theater. The Trey Stone Matt Parker creation runs there through May 11th. USA Today recently published a list of the 10 best museums for families. Here's the top five. At number five, the Discovery Center Museum in Rockford, Illinois. Number four, the Musical Instrument Museum in Phoenix, Arizona. Number three, the New Mexico Museum of Natural History and Science in Albuquerque. Number two, the Children's Museum of Houston. And at number one, the Children's Museum of Indianapolis. Currently showing at the Art Institute of Chicago is an exhibit called When Greeks Ruled Egypt. It focuses on the 300-year Greek rule that began with Alexander the Great and ended with the suicide of Queen Cleopatra. This exhibition explores how these two different cultures influenced each other. On display are over 75 works of art including masks, magical amulets, and luxury glass. Hey, thanks for watching. Make sure to watch the full morning canvas every weekday from 7 a.m. till 9 a.m. See you tomorrow. Want more daily doses? Click on the video to the left and please subscribe.